This is Scott with Seconds to No One Canine Life Coaching. I've got a canine observation question for you guys. Precious, this white one is deaf. Blue, that's over there. I don't know if you guys can see him very well. Is mine. All blue wants to do is run and be chased. Is that a dominant personality trait? He doesn't like to play chase. He wants to be chased. Precious is learning new play styles, so she's going to engage him to play. But the thing is, he's not as interested if it's not his way. If he doesn't get to be the fast one, he's not as interested and he does something else like pee on the ground. See, he's more than happy to run and play if he gets to be in the lead. If she gets to run first, he doesn't want to do it as much. Oh, Blue, let's go. That's his game. Well, bully breed, he's not much of a wrestler. about done blue thank you bell you ready blue come on move bell Blue, ready? Come on, go. See, so with all that, sorry about the fence shot, all Blue really cares about is running around and being chased. If it comes to doing anything else, he's not comfortable with that. I know. You have a bat sore back leg, you can't do it. So, so I ask you again, who is the dominant player. I gotta put this piece of wood back. Is it blue for wanting to only do it his way? Or is it precious trying to match him and trying to figure out something else so she can play as well? Who's dominant? 